How you guys doing? Of course, you know, this is very important in reverence to the lies of government and the activity of them calling me a criminal and damaging my teeth. They need to express in uh, YouTube videos and on uh, websites what kind of criminal that they have tried to accuse me of being as they have damaged my face and teeth, you know. These people have damaged my teeth trying to call me a criminal. You know, I've never been arrested. I'm not allowed to be arrested. There's a document to tell you why. And these people tried to murder me to steal my mother and father's estates. The real protocols in the media 24 hours a day of my identity. And they need to know what class of people was doing this and have been terrorizing my life. Uh, are they first world country, second world country, third world country people, or fourth world country people? Meaning like they came into America or they got into government. Just because you're in government does not make you a first world country person. Does not make you the controller of everybody's personal lives or private lives or, or their careers. Government does not entitled to steal estates or to block me from my mother and father's estates. And my mother even had it on record that anybody contesting my ownership must get arrested and that's what the law supports. And there's laws in reference to when I was little, when I had been injured, that said if anybody damaged me or in injured me at all ever again, they were supposed to get fucking arrested immediately, even if it was a government person of a high-ranking position. And we need the Supreme Court to put those laws on a website so everybody in America and everybody in the world can see those documents. See, they had to make specific laws to protect me from con artists, thieves, uh, gold digging type people, people that would burn on me, people that would try to murder me. Because, you know, my father got murdered from satellite. And the Treasury does have that on record, don't they? My father was frozen after he had gotten murdered. So in reference to politicians, government agents, political figures, or whoever anybody is, anybody burning me, torturing me, blocking me from my money, causing me problems of any kind, harassing me of any kind, it tells you on those treasury documents that people are supposed to get arrested or sued, and the treasury was supposed to send money to me. Because most of these people wouldn't have the amount of money that they'd be getting sued for. So the Treasury has to subsidize the lawsuits. And the Treasury is not allowed to endanger me by trying to make me have to go after them in court. When the Treasury and the Supreme Court knows that these people would try to murder me at any chance that they could ever get. You know, and some people, they always, and they always make these videos look like shit. You know, some people say, well, he don't really look so much like that, but the video or whatever, you know. The activity of uh, the government man trying to make me look like shit as their way of torturing me and abusing me or trying to confuse my identity. And my dental records are on record. They've been on record my whole life. So we need the exact name of the man or woman or whoever they were that ever called my teeth fake. And they must get prosecuted based on the facts of them making up lies to damage my face and teeth. I was born with royal diplomatic immunity. I was born as the owner of my mother and father's estates. My parents even had it on record that my parents had me intentionally my mother intentionally got pregnant. My father intentionally impregnated my mother for me to be born. For me to be the owner of the estates of my mother and father. And that is on documents at the American Treasury and other places. So in reference to the government slandering my character, damaging my teeth because they were trying to slander my history, or they were trying to slander my lifestyle as they were holding me hostage, covering up that they had kidnapped me from my mother and father's mansions. They covered up that they were holding on to birth records or uh, driver's license with my birth name on it. And they intentionally have tried to call me Mark Ray all these years as their way of holding me hostage. They've been stealing the postal mail. They've been burning me with satellites. They've been burning me on jobs. 
And uh, if the United Nations has records of any of these satellite controllers, they can, uh, you know, they can start filing or start prosecution against the American government, you know, because my parents own businesses and property and, and houses in other countries, too. So, you know, in reference to the American government and the dirty activities of these politicians or government agents, they are in violation of factual international protection laws. My mother and father had products that were, you know, imported or deported, or not, or, you know, imported or exported to other countries. Exported, you know. But, you know, the activity of these government people and these satellite controllers, you know, all their activities of mutilation needed uh, explained why they thought they could get into my life and terrorize my life after my parents had gotten murdered by the American government and corrupt politicians that illegally faked their history, faked their identities, faked and forged documents and fabricated lies and they fabricated videos or falsified uh, signatures or they falsified and forged documents to try to steal everything from me. That's why the Royal Protocol is in the media. So no matter what anybody says, no matter what documents they got, I am the owner of my mother and father's estates. Now in reference to the slander that came from these people, it's very important to know exactly what race and religion they are. To analyze what kind of person these people are and how much they have lied their asses off to try to steal everything from me as their way of extorting and stealing even when they are tied in with the government people that had murdered my parents and people that had injured me when I was a little boy these government agents should have been prosecuted a long time ago but obviously the courts are not doing their job efficiently enough and the satellite man has still been burning me every day and they're burning my teeth and mouth right now at this exact time and the Supreme Court would know that because the Supreme Court has documents over there and uh, and so does the Treasury they have you know technology that can detect where the satellite controllers have been looking at such as them looking at me and it's 7.54 p.m. 9-9-2022. So in reference to these government people and their lies and their tricks and their manipulations, they must go to court. I have not received any compensation. I'm still being held hostage. I have not received anything from any city or state uh, out of any of the cities in America or any of the governors or mayors. And some of them are probably pretty cool, friendly individuals, and they have records. They even Somebody tried to say that even Duke Farms had went to every governor's office in America and had presented DNA information, factual documents of my identity in all 50 states. Well, obviously, Indiana seems to claim they don't know nothing about it or something. But somebody had communicated that they had went to all the different, and even went to other police stations. They went to many police stations and gave them documents of my birth records and who my biological parents are, is what somebody had tried to communicate or something. But yet I still have not received nothing in the postal mail, still being burnt from satellites, and nobody has stopped any of these criminals. And there is a history and a track record of these people stalking me. There's restraining orders. There's history of these people violating my anatomy. These people fabricating lies on me when people know where I'm at all the time. And this satellite man is still burning my teeth, burning my mouth, and they're trying to make up mouth diseases. That government man must be prosecuted for damaging my teeth and any of these criminals that tried to copy my teeth or anybody that tried to copy my face, those people need to go to court. The activities of government burning my teeth, snaggle toothing, damaging my teeth, they need to explain what they were trying to do. You know, I had a lot of injuries when I was a little boy from thieves. 
and the activities they had to make new laws specific laws to protect me from dirty government dirty thieves political scams political hidden agendas and yet these people had caused me more teeth damage than than I pretty much ever had I guess you'd say in some acknowledgments from their crimes and the fact that they accused me and they're still recycling their lies still playing their games still burning me claiming they weren't doing nothing when they have stolen billions of dollars from me and they've lost in court to me and yet I still have not received nothing and yet they're still burning my mouth they're still burning my teeth and I am not their property I am not their child I'm not their race or religion and they're not any friends of mine whoever these satellite controllers are the facts of law these people tried to mess up my body they tried to mess up my face they tried to murder me several times to steal my identity to steal my mother and father's estates from me and these people are tied in government and the Treasury and Supreme Court have it on record that my father and mother had gotten murdered by people that was tied in with government and yet the government has not delivered any monies to the mailbox the treasuries or governors or mayors or any fans that tried to send me anything these government people have stolen everything and this is you know such a disgrace to the activities of law which obviously these satellite controllers and their government people are pretending like they don't know America has different laws than where these people came from I don't know if uh, which political family hired assassins to try to murder me but somebody knows who they are and that has to be put on a website and publicly mentioned in the media well, protocols in the media of my identity 24 hours a day it's a blueprint of my identity and who I am and who my parents are and what I'm the owner of